quite born and bred, but this is my home. I now have a flat in the city and I work in the city. I've worked here pretty much since I left university. I love this place. And I thought Manchester showed Britain at its best for the last two weeks. I'm sure you and your viewers will agree. And it's now London's turn to step up. And I think we'll do that. We did it in 2005. We've done it on other occasions. I thought Sadiq Khan spoke beautifully for our city and on behalf of all Londoners this the morning. The Mayor of London did a great job. To, yeah, he symbolises that unity and diversity that we love about London. And we're not going to let these people win. And I keep saying, if me having a gin and tonic with my friends, flirting with handsome men, hanging out with brilliant women is what offends these people so much I'm gonna do it more not less because that's what makes London so great that's what makes it the best city in the world and we're gonna go out and enjoy it more and I'm, I'm more determined than ever to love the city that looks after me and the emergency services were just phenomenal like they were there within seconds they kept us safe they swept the place and then two things really struck with me one when we were leaving the police were our eyes and ears as we're trying to avoid blood or people's shoes that have fallen off or dropped wallets or whatever. They were our eyes and ears and they kept us safe. But secondly, I noticed the paramedic that was looking after a woman who was sadly face down on the ground, there's a couple of them, and thought they run at danger. Then they turn their back to danger to put together the life in front of them while we're running for our lives behind them. And I thought that, I don't know, I, I, I'd not thought about it in that way before, but they, they seem to be the most vulnerable at that point and they did a remarkable thing and I might never meet the people who made judgments that potentially saved my life last night but I'm thankful to those people and I hope London hugs them in lots of ways and and, and clearly you're saying in every way life life carries on London Absolutely. bounces back in the way that we've seen Manchester bounce they back. They hate our democracy go vote people they hate our equality go and meet somebody you haven't met before from a different part of the world I was having dinner with an Australian like next time it should be with someone from Pakistan or Africa or whatever like that's what's so great about London and small-minded cowardly evil people should not change our way of life they won't make me scared on the streets of London and I just think the people of Manchester have inspired us in the last fortnight and I hope the Londoners do their bit and I am confident they will step up to the plate.